Hey everybody, Rabbit back here with a new video. I hope you're all doing wicked awesome. I do want to say, uh, I did get, uh, 300 subs, so I do want to say thanks to everybody watching, um, and, uh, who subscribes and comments and any of that. And, uh, yeah, I really, really appreciate it. And, uh, you're all just, uh, friggin' awesome. So, I have some cool stuff here that i gotten over the last few weeks. And, uh, we'll just go over it pretty quick, because you can see what it is. I did complete the Ghostbusters logo there. I found, uh, Winston and Egon. And, um, I like the, uh the logo thing, it's really cool, it's well done, um, very, uh, heavy duty, you know, sturdy plastic, nice, uh, clear stand, and the glow in the dark works great, and as for the figures, I do like them, I actually think the likenesses look better than the Marvel Selects, except for the Marvel Select Ray, looks pretty good and uh... But that's it uh... so yeah moving on there I did get in the uh... rebel tech war machine mini um, the smaller version uh... i did get the iron man mini uh, a while ago and just such an awesome figure that i did finally get the war machine as well and he came with a whole bunch of stuff and behind him, you can see uh, it's actually this uh, kind of a game. It's, it's all in Japanese, but um, they're you know pretty well articulated figures. Um, wouldn't say super articulated, but you can get them in just pretty nice poses, and uh, they're pretty neat. You know, they're stylized after the artwork there which is all you know anime style but I like them they're really really well priced and uh, you know got here pretty fast from Japan and they're fun and can go back in the box so pretty neat some old and new Marvel Universe there and all the way on the left there you can see the Secret Wars uh, with Magneto and Black Suit Spidey which is one I've been after for forever um, and uh, just finally found a great price and it's in great condition it was it's excellent uh, and go real well with the um, graded Secret Wars comic I have now and I'm just just super stoked to have that and uh, a couple of the single carded ones the Gamora, the old uh, suit Daredevil, <clears throat> I did get a second Armored Spidey because the one I got before, you know, I wanted to just keep it on the card and it was pretty mashed up, so this one's uh, very good condition, so I'll just open the other one. And then the Hydro Man, which I was very excited about very cool figure. The water effect is just amazing in person. Um, you know, pretty simple, but just very nice, clear plastic with the blue. I did get the old Iceman from the Origins toy line, and the Colossus, because I, I really like those versions and wanted them for a while. have, you know, most of the other versions of those characters. And, um, yeah, I really like those characters, so I finally, you know, added them. Really awesome, the movie Iron Monger, uh, the 3.75 inch figure. It's, uh, just an amazing figure. And that packaging as well is just in great condition. It's nice to see. Um, uh, it's just a great figure. Glad to have that finally. Uh, I did pick up the old Magneto, the uh, open mouth yelling variant. I've had the 
other one for quite a while, and this one's just been sitting for a good price at the comic shop, so snag that. And then I did get the Civil War 3-pack in there, and it is wicked awesome. The repaints are really well done. The Tony Stark head is very nice. It's got an awesome likeness. And the Spider-Man, even though it's not film accurate, it is an amazing figure. It's one of my favorite Spider-Man figures. Um, it's just it poses great and it looks great so uh, just a really nice three pack uh, and then did get the Black Panther and Sharon Carter 3.75 two pack uh, that was off of the Toys R Us website actually and I had a free shipping thing so it came to 19.99 shipped which was awesome because uh, you know everywhere else was too much money. And I did pick up some mystery minis along the way. The Sharon Carter it was a double, and the Hawkeye was a double. Uh, I did give one of the Hawkeyes to my uh, nephew. So still no Black Panther, but I did get an Ant-Man and Vision, which were the other two I really wanted to have. And uh, all the other ones there are really well done, too. So. You know, these these are really cool. stopped inside a Toys R Us to see what was kicking. Uh, usually nothing, and there was pretty much, pretty much nothing. I mean, uh, some things here and there, but nothing I really wanted. There is a, uh, Comic Con, a small one, uh, kind of local around here I'm going to tomorrow. So I kind of wanted to save most of my money for that, but I had wanted to get the new Ultimate, uh, Tech Noir Arnold, and they had a couple, so I picked the best, and all the hairlines are perfect. That's always something that irks me when those are uh, the paint is off on those. So this one was great, and um, yeah, I love it. I still have the original with the static legs. I think those forceps are new. I'm not sure. Um, I don't think those came with any of the older versions. And then I did run into a Walgreens and uh, didn't have any new Legends. I had uh, a couple of these Vaders that I have been wanting to pick this up so that I can repaint the helmet and maybe make it into a normal uh, Empire Strikes Back Vader. So I did uh, nab that. Got a couple Mystery Minis there as well. Uh, I don't have it it's up there on the shelf, but um, I did get um, a double, unfortunately, a double of Ant-Man, but uh, I gave that to a buddy, and I did get uh, Captain America, which I needed, so really just need uh, Falcon and Black Panther at this point. Really cool, and I do like how the cloth on this one, you know, it's uh, much better, um, you know, fitted and not as long not as much material and uh, just uh, drapes very nicely perfectly now so that's cool alright it is a few days later and my space venom wave showed up very excited to have these figures they all look very good and um, yeah very excited to have them I really thought I'd have the X-Men wave by now and this wave next month 
but that got switched, so that's alright. I'll just keep uh, patiently waiting for those. Uh, these look great, and I do like the Space Venom. I'm going to check these figures out and get the Space Venom built. Um, and, uh, yeah, pretty soon I'll have another collection video out. Just have to uh, decide uh, what and uh, get it cleaned up a bit. And I think that'll do it for this video. Um, again, I really, really appreciate everyone for watching. And thanks to uh, all old and new subscribers. Uh, thanks for leaving a comment or anything like that. Very much appreciate it. So that will do it, everybody. I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Take care. Peace.